Riku? Is there something on my face? You've been glancing at me since a while ago. N no it's nothing. Lately, I feel like Moe has become really beautiful. I wonder if she has someone she likes. Just being next to her makes my heart race. Riku, I knew you were looking. I said I wasn't. Moe, you're just too self-conscious. Don't try to dodge the question. I know you were looking. <laughs> Am I really that attractive? Stop teasing me! Clear eyes, lustrous lips, beautiful hair, well-proportioned features. Anyone would say that Moe is a beautiful girl. Come on, we're gonna be late if we don't hurry up. All right, all right. It's true that I, Riku Togashi, a high school junior, was looking at my childhood friend Moe Akida. That's because I like her, so I can't help but look at her. But I'm too scared to confess my feelings. I'm afraid that if she rejects me, our current relationship will be ruined. Moe has been extremely shy since she was little, and she couldn't have a proper conversation with anyone other than me, so she was always alone at school. Maybe I fell in love with her because I couldn't leave her like that, and we were always together. Good morning. Good morning. <sighs> They're walking to school together again, looking so close. One day, I had to take a day off from school because of a cold. My fever just won't go down. Oh, Moe dear, did you come to visit Riku? Yes, can you give this to Riku for me? Thank you, I'll take it. So you don't catch Riku's cold. Okay, please take care. I could hear Moe's voice from downstairs. She came to visit me, and my mom was taking care of her. Even though she talks tough to me, Moe is really kind at heart. It took me three days to finally get my fever down and return to school. Riku, I was so lonely without you. Really? Yeah, really. I was convinced that Moe had romantic feelings for me too. I thought I had no choice but to confess. A few days later, I gathered my courage and called Moe out to the back of the high school gym. Moe, I like you. I want you to be my girlfriend. No way! Shock! I saw the confession scene with Riku, the guy I like. <sighs> Moe, are you listening? I do like Riku, but if we start dating, that means holding hands with him. And what comes after that? Uh, wow, can I do it? But if I say yes right away, it'll make me look easy. I think I read online that it's better to put him on hold for a while. Hey, what do you think about me? Can you wait for my answer? God! She won't say yes right away. Why? How long do I have to wait? Can you wait two weeks? Two weeks, huh? Okay. Two weeks? That means I still have a chance. I just need to make Ryu's feelings turn towards me in those two weeks. I've been unrequitedly in love with him since our freshman year, but Riku was always with his childhood friend Moe, and I never got a chance to get close to him. I have to do something. I had no idea that Misa Kanda from our class was watching Moe and me. And that day, I felt too awkward to walk home with Moe, so I went home alone. Two weeks is a long time. If I get rejected after waiting for that long, I don't think I'll be able to recover. But what's the reason for making me wait? I couldn't bring myself to talk about this with my friends. It felt like a secret between Moe and me. But feeling lonely, I decided to look up female psychology on the internet. Reasons a girl might hold off on answering a confession. She wants to evaluate the guy who's more than just a friend. She's torn between her feelings for him and someone else. She can't refuse, so she asks the guy to wait. I should stop! Looking this up only makes me worry more! The only thing I can do now is to act the same way around Moe as I always have. Moe must be aware of my feelings too, so there's nothing else I can do! The next morning, as usual, I went to pick up Moe before going to school. Hey Moe, after school I have a place I want to stop by, so I'll be going home alone. Okay, I understand. By the way, Moe, how about you? Will you be okay going to and from school with me for these two weeks until you give me your answer? I might not be... okay. Alright, I got it. We're always together, right? 
I think it's good to have some alone time every once in a while. For two weeks, let's go to and from school separately. But in the classroom, let's act as usual around each other. Is that okay? Yeah. Uh, this has become such a weird situation. I'm such a bad girl. I read online that responding okay right away would make me seem too easy. So I asked for time, but maybe two weeks was too long. But in my plan, I wanted to give Riku my answer on his birthday, which is two weeks away. What should I do? Should I just give him my answer today? But I really want to do it on Riku's birthday. Moe doesn't seem to be in a good mood. I wonder what's wrong. It's weird that she would feel down after being confessed to by Riku, right? She must be planning to turn him down. This is my chance. I'll definitely make Riku fall for me. Ugh, Moe is so cute. I can't help but keep looking at her. But what will happen to me in two weeks? After school that day, I went to the bookstore to look for a math reference book. Ugh, it's hard to decide which one to buy. Maybe I should rely on online reviews after all. Uh, Riku. Misa. I came to look for an English workbook. Are you looking for something too? I'm looking for a math reference book. Math is my weak point. Even someone with good grades like you has weak points, huh? You have good grades too, right? Hey, how about this? I'm good at math, so I'll teach you math. You're good at English, so you'll teach me English. Isn't that a good idea? I think it's a good idea, but... Then come to my place after school tomorrow. It's not a good idea to be alone together. Why? We're just studying. It's hard to teach in the library because we have to be quiet, right? So isn't my place better? I think I'll be fine if I read the reference book. If I don't understand something, I'll ask you for help at school. I see. Hey, when you're done buying the reference book, do you want to walk home together part of the way? It might take a while, so can you go ahead without me? Okay. <sighs> He's tough. He's definitely avoiding being alone with me. How nice for Moe to be thought of like that. If Riku confessed to me, I would say yes right away. The next morning. Hey Riku, did you end up buying a reference book after all? I couldn't decide, so I didn't buy one yesterday. Did they spend the whole time together after that? Are you going to the bookstore again today? I think I'll look at some online reviews and think about it some more. When you go to the bookstore, invite me too. Huh? Why? I think we get along well, and I've always wanted to talk more with you. Really? But we can talk at school, right? Class is starting. Misa went back to her seat. Misa suddenly started talking to me more. Why? It's true that she'd be a good person to teach me, but I need to spend these two weeks carefully. Yesterday after school, Riku was with Misa. Ugh, it's bothering me. Should I just give him my answer now? But I want to give my answer on Riku's birthday. If our anniversary is on his birthday, we'll never forget it. Hurry up, birthday! After school that day, I had to stay late to work on my overdue art assignment, so I was walking home alone. Riku, help me! Huh? Misa? What's going on? It seems like someone is following me. Riku, can you walk home with me? T sure but we should report this to the police. It's okay, I've lost him. But... More importantly, can we hold hands? Huh, why? I'm scared, holding hands will make me feel safe. All right. You don't have to hold so tight. Thank you, I feel safe now. Hey, have you ever held hands with a girl before? Why are you asking that? Just curious. I can hear your heartbeat. Well, of course, I'm nervous. To calm down more, let's link arms while we walk. No, that's really embarrassing. <sighs> I feel so safe. How cruel. Uh, Molly! No, this isn't what it looks like. Sticky, 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 sticky. I won't let it go. Stay away from Riku! Riku is mine! Hey, Moe, stop! 
He's not yours yet. I like Rigo too. You're the one who put his confession on hold, aren't you? <sighs> How did you know? I saw Riku confessing to you, but I've liked Riku for a long time, so I don't want you to take him away from me. Isn't it cool to keep him waiting for two weeks? If it were me, I'd say yes right away. I wouldn't make Riku suffer. Misa, I'm happy to know how you feel, but the one I like is Moe, so I'm sorry. <sighs> I can't compete with your long history together, huh? I'll walk you home. It's dangerous for you to go alone. Thank you, but I'll be fine. I wasn't really being followed. Actually, I was the one following you. I wanted to talk to you, so I waited. I'm sorry. Misa went home alone. Riku, I read on the internet that if I accept your confession too quickly, it might seem shallow. What? I wouldn't think that. If you were going to say yes, I'd be happier to get an answer right away. So, does this mean that you're saying yes? But why two weeks? That's too long, isn't it? Well, will you promise not to get mad? Is it something that would make me mad? I'm not sure, but, um, I wanted our anniversary to be two weeks later, on your birthday. That way, we'd never forget it, right? Oh, right. My birthday is in two weeks. I forgot. But there are still a few days left until my birthday, right? Do you still want to make my birthday our anniversary? It feels like you're going to say yes, so please don't keep me waiting. I want to hear a clear yes now. I want to hear your answer. Fine, I won't insist on your birthday. Are you sure? Yeah, because you held hands with Misa and linked arms with her. I can't wait any longer. Moe, are you jealous? Riku, I love you. Please go out with me. Wow, of course! I've been waiting for this day forever! What? Why am I giving you a piggyback ride? Isn't this the time for a hug or a kiss? Hugs and kisses are on hold until your birthday. Holding hands and linking arms like Misa did are too ordinary. Piggyback rides are special. I can feel your warmth with my entire body. You're really unique, Moe. Hey, come to my house on your birthday. It's a Sunday and no one will be there, so we'll be alone. What? Let's go! Well, it's been so long since I've had a piggyback ride. You used to give me piggyback rides a lot, right? That was back in elementary school, right? Anyway, Moe, you've really grown in many ways. Hey, you're embarrassing me! There were many ups and downs and thrilling moments that led us here. For now, I'll look forward to my birthday. I am happy!